Welcome back, friends, to the Art Digital Show. I hope you enjoyed yourself in the previous two episodes. Today, we have more cool content to show you. Presenting an amazingly talented artist, Giulia Randalupo. And furthermore, we will present the profile of Carlo Tozzi, founder and art director of START. For now, I pass the word to Carlo to introduce our next artist. is a remarkably talented and established illustration artist, creative director and art educator. Originally from Naples, Julia now lives in Paris and does illustrations and concept for Louvre Museum magazine for kids. The sake of exploring human behavior and boundaries, reaching audacious scenarios while meshing pure sentiments uh, with indiscreet ones is what led Julia to what her art is recognized today. Her pastels are literally magic. Start is really obsessed by the drawing talent of this incredible artist and illustrator. Her huge capability to represent social and anthropological themes showing a developed knowledge of human behaviors, especially the daring and sexual ones. Her colored pastels, pencils, and china ink depict all human vulnerabilities through a lighter creative approach. Her illustrations have been featured by Le Monde, Villa Medici Academy, Louvre, just to mention a few. Please take your time, enjoy the details illustrated with extreme acumen by the artist, the maestri in the use of background collage, her subjects so topical and expressive, her enormous courage and commitment to represent main social and political issues with no fear. We love Julia and her magic pastels. Subtle is the difference between depth and heaviness. Everything, even the most beautiful, is heavy and opaque without dreams. Dreams that walk hand in hand with poetry, generating a magic that lifts the weights, that choke us like little bitter morsels. Too many times, lightly, the crime of heaviness is committed. In that moment, even without gravity, everything becomes heavy, empty. A vacuum is created. The more life becomes empty, the heavier it becomes. Then run away, go away, pack your bags. Remember to bring light luggage. You will be less tired and more willing to embrace what new you may find. Heart, there are paths that can be walked, bringing one baggage only, the heart. It is carefully stored in the best lined bag. It is a fragile object, difficult to reassemble after it breaks. Bags. There are hiding places, and then there are bags. 
bags are a woman's unconscious where she stores objects, desires, and memories, pieces of life, all in one bag. It may be for this reason that robbers always ask, or the purse, or the life. Maybe there isn't much difference between the two. Bags that are lost property, office and found property at the same time. Big bags for big guilt. Small bags for great promises never kept. Bags full of things that can always serve. Laboratory of good intentions, hopes and projects. Complex and deep containers where even when you reach the bottom with your hand, we always find something that surprises us, just like your gentle, brave owners. So, I hope you have enjoyed Julia's talent. Don't forget you can acquire her artworks. You can find them on the link below. And if you buy them this week until Sunday, you save 20%. So don't lose this great chance. Hi, I'm Karis and I'm an artist based in Amsterdam and I'm a curator at Start. I've been with the company for just over a year now and I met Carla through Instagram. I was looking for an art community to join and I started an artist internship with the company and since then we've just been working together and with the team and just discovering new artists and it's just been a really nice journey to be a part of. Finally today, it's the time to portray our founder and art director, Carlo Tozzi. I have always been passionate of art, but only recently in my life, following a dream uh, I had and working hard to convert it into a vision, I've become an art director. I'm living inside my vision now and in all these beautiful colors of art. I'm Italian, born in Naples to be precise, but living in Amsterdam. I've grown up in a family full of art. My father was an artist, my mother a deep art lover. I'm an artist myself. I'm also an engineer. Hmm, duality. I know, <laughs> that's pretty confusing. I've exhibited my work around Europe, uh, Amsterdam, London, Madrid, uh, The Hague. But today, I feel like a man of art, but also an entrepreneur and especially a visionary. Believe me, art unites people, makes them feel better. Art creates dreams, business, and a huge emotional satisfaction. Art improves us all. Having art home is like meeting a good friend every day and speaking of different subjects with him. It taught me that what you give, you give to yourself. While what, whatever you don't give, you take away from yourself. Start is the reflection of this vision. The art of making things happen and it gives me so much satisfaction.
Start has made it a priority to facilitate the acquisition of art, merging the gap between artists and collectors. By bringing art into the daily routine of our public, offering the opportunity for everyone to become a potential collector. Start brings a large selection of various artists to public spaces, offices, bureaus, and private homes. Using our online rental bidding sales models, we facilitate the process of acquisition, along with creating attractive shows, expanding our reach and accessibility to our clients and potential future collectors. We aim to please also with digital events, bringing the art directly into your homes, if online or offline. Also coming soon, a brand new auction platform focused on emerging artists. So now I think about that day after our first meeting and I see all what we did up to now, you know, all these exhibitions in London, in Milan, in Amsterdam, and all the internships, you know, the new website, all what we do for the artists, with the buyers. So I'm so impressed and so proud to, to be part of starting. Well, we hope you really have enjoyed the show so far. But please, let us tease you a little bit more with a selection of artworks from other start artists. You will see them and their talent very soon in other shows and events. By the way, did you know that we just upgraded our web platform? StartAmsterdam.com has improved the services, the galleries, the workshops and including new services like online options and coaching. Check it out and enjoy your user experience with Start. And for the last time, perhaps, I don't like art. This time I don't like art because it's not open to change. It's true. Everyone likes to visit an art exhibition and enjoy the experience physically, sensorially, to look at an artwork. But let me say, the gradual trend of art towards digital is inevitable. It's happening. It was happening already before COVID. And there's no going back. Artists all around the world have to have the possibility, they deserve the possibility to express their own talent instead of giving up to, to mediocrity. And the art market needs as much of it possible to renew itself continuously. From this idea, the, uh, the factory developed itself. It puts together physical events and digital. But there's always a, a presentation as a a, an intimate, an interesting, an attractive show to anyone. We will do physical events, but there's a, always going to be a digital component of it, so that we can reach everyone. Start is planning art events in St. Moritz, in Milan, in the US, but we will make sure we will always reach you, wherever you are. So, we hope you have enjoyed this crazy, crazy way to present art. We hope you have enjoyed it as much as we have enjoyed doing it. See you very soon with Start Factory and stay tuned.